It's two of the most cloned coasters on Earth, the Vacoma SLC and the Vacoma Boomerang. You can find these at parks across the world. In this video, I'll be pitting the two coaster types against each other. To represent the Vacoma SLC, I'll be showing you video of Fly the Great Nor'easter at Maury's Piers, and the Carolina Cobra at Carowinds to represent the Vacoma Boomerang. And since I've ridden more than one of each of these, I feel that I have a better idea of what all of these coasters are like. So anyways, for this coaster fight, we're going to hit several different categories, and then at the end we will determine the winner. So let's first start with the height of these two rides. Each SLC are 109 feet tall, and each boomerang are 117 feet tall. Not that big of a difference, we're only talking about 8 feet but I'm gonna give it to the boomerang. Next is the drop. This is how good each of the drops are. And I'm gonna give this to the boomerang because you fall forwards and backwards, which is something you don't get to do with the SLC, which is really cool. Plus, it's a better drop. Now we're talking about how fast these coasters are. The boomerang reaches a maximum speed of 47 miles per hour, and the SLC reaches a maximum speed of 50 miles an hour. Only a three mile an hour difference, but I'm gonna give this one to the SLC because it is faster. Ah, the smoothness category. I wouldn't describe either one of these coasters as totally smooth, but it is a night and day difference between which one of these coasters is smoother. Out of all of the boomerangs that I've ridden and all of the SLCs that I've ridden, the boomerang is glossy smooth compared to how smooth the SLC is. Every SLC I've ridden is really, really unbearably rough. For me, that is the reason why I'm not a fan of SLCs and I prefer boomerangs. I've never found any of the boomerangs to be really rough. It might cause your head to shake a little bit back and forth, but that's about it. Next, we're talking about how long these two rides are. Each Vekoma SLC runs for approximately 1 minute and 36 seconds, and each Boomerang runs for approximately 1 minute and 48 seconds. That is about a 12 second difference, and I imagine that the main reason for that difference is because the Boomerang takes you up to the top of the second spike. So that second lift is probably the reason why the Boomerang is longer. But nonetheless, I do have to give it to the longer ride, so the Boomerang is going to earn another point. Next up is the Intensity category. I'm going to give this to the Boomerang, and here's why. On every single Vekoma boomerang, you pull approximately 5.2 Gs. That's quite a bit. These are forceful coasters. Next up is the inversions. We're talking about how good the inversions are. Each Vekoma SLC includes a rollover, a sidewinder, and a double inline twist. Each boomerang includes a cobra roll and a vertical loop. And on the boomerang, you experience each of those inversions twice. Now you might think that the SLC should get this one because it includes more inversions, its inversions are more diverse. But I'm going to give this to the Boomerang because it has a forceful vertical loop, and normally I'm not huge fans of Cobra rolls, but I actually don't mind it on the Vekoma Boomerang. It's not too bad, and overall, I like the inversions better on the Boomerang than the SLC. So that is the final category for this coaster fight, which means that the Vekoma Boomerang has won this fight by 5 points. Congratulations! Now you might have noticed that I didn't include every category that I normally include with each coaster fight. And the reason is because we're dealing with a ride category and not individual rides. So categories like theming and restraints have been excluded from this fight because they can differ per coaster. And obviously there can be a little bit of difference between some of these coasters, but overall I have found that the Vekoma Boomerang is much better than the SLC. So that concludes this coaster fight. Which one do you like better? Make sure to stay tuned on my channel for more coaster fights. And you can also check out a full playlist, which I have previous coaster fights in there, so you can check those out. And once again, thank you for watching.